if there is one thing that I'm constantly try, um, striving for is, uh, how can I say, improvement in myself, improvement in many fields, I'm always trying to achieve a lot. I feel like maybe um, there are some things that I can currently work on to be better and then, you know, branch out into a new goal or a new, you know, success that I want to reach. But I feel like one very important one is the connection that I try to build between my head, my mind, and my chest, my heart. These two things, I feel like they should always be able to collaborate with one another, especially with how I speak, how I act upon my my actions, my intentions, and obviously my emotions. So I want to be able to act out or speak with a lot of logic, a lot of sense, a lot of um, thought. So when I'm actually speaking with people, I'm invoking some type of you know feeling or I'm invoking some type of critical thinking. People must be able to hear me speak and think about what I'm saying. I want people to be able to enlighten and work their minds into you know being the, these types of beings or these being these types of creative minds that are always you know analyzing what's being said, trying to read, trying to decipher the message. Because I feel like a lot of us just you know absorb. The, all this information without actually taking it into account of what it actually meant what's the depth between it now if that's not something you obviously want to achieve in your life that's cool but for me i just feel like if i'm able to build a mind where i can speak to people and they think or uh, the way i'm able to decipher or be able to receive messages 100 percent clearly with understanding with context with the feeling with every single um type of thought or emotion you can put in what you say i want to be able to completely understand that and another thing is my heart my chest my feelings i want to be able to be emotionally intelligent a person who's just able to take into account how they should act you know while colorate while colorating their feelings while you know trying to realize that i can't just be having an outburst or i can't just be having an immediate reaction i should be able to process the situation i should be able to process what i've received the type of maybe dilemma that i'm in or the type of i don't know problem that i might be facing and not just beat down myself into some depression some sad state or anger i should not just be lashing out my my feelings should be able to be justified not only justified but also benefit me in what i'm doing so if i'm able to use my mind and my heart to basically create this type of mindset or this type of body or this type of thinking where or mentality i feel like it is the better word so i can be able to move forward in life in a very how can i say calculated very well structured well structured way i feel like i'll be much more happy with myself and i'll be able to realize that when i speak when i feel when i think when i'm you know expressing emotions how i say things it'll make much more sense and i'll be much more happy and much more how can i say fulfilled in what i do in how i think and i want to have these second thoughts or you know thoughts of doubt of what i am doing because i have already created a connection between my mind and my heart and my feelings to that point where i won't feel any doubt or i won't feel any disappointment for anything that i put out or express my energy into um yeah i feel like uh, a lot of people should work towards that i feel as though some people do not give that much attention to you know how they think and how they feel they just lash out and that's just not how you're supposed to carry yourself as a human being as a person you obviously got to try and understand that in certain situations everybody's on a different step and everybody's on a different level of life you know life crisis life challenges we all go through different things so trying to understand that trying to understand yourself trying to see what level you on and you know maybe like understand the levels other people are on it could be very beneficial to the individual it could be very beneficial to other people as you were able to um, communicate much more clearly connect much more clearly and people will be able to understand you or you'll be able to understand people instantly because it's something you've trained yourself to do and it just feels like a very very important skill i feel like it's something you it's something you obviously got to work towards it's not something you're just born with or talented it's something that you got to take time you know in your life in your in your in your spare in your spare time or just in general in situations you can practice it out seeing how you can call it correlate or collaborate or link your brain and your heart on how to deal with situations very important thing that i feel i want to be able to um do and push forward in my life and i feel like a lot of people should also kind of like in ingrain that in theirs yeah so other than that god bless have a nice life and i'll see you when i see you